Hello everybody, and this is our crew at Vicomedia and RIS, and um, so this is a quick, quick tutorial on how to install the Too Many Items mod. Uh, great mod, it's an in-game inventory editor, so if you want to, to build something really cool um, and you don't have the materials, it's very useful, or you want to test out um, items from a mod or anything like that, this is very, very cool, um, much easier than single player commands or other mods where you have to uh, close the game and, and use a program. So, um, very simple instructions, go to the description of this video and um, there will be a link similar to this, this file will be updated for uh, any updates, currently um, the May 4th one, so uh, just download and you'll get a zip folder just like this one, and when you unzip it, you'll get this. <clears throat> um, it says client, but this mod does work on multiplayer and single player. You do not need to mod the server though. Um, you just have to be an op, so you have permissions to um, spawn items, and that's about it. Um, here you see um, two folders, or two zip folders. Um, WinRAR 64-bit and 32-bit. Pick whichever one is for your system. If you don't know which one uh, or which version of Windows you have, just do 32-bit. Um, and then we can go into this client folder here. And then here is a readme that has all the steps that I'm going to cover here. And um, the jar files are just just the few files that uh, too many need, too many items need to work. So. What we're going to want to uh, do is first, after you've installed WinRAR, um, go to your start menu, percent, app, data, percent, right, and then enter. And this will open a brand new folder here that's normally hidden, and you double click dot Minecraft, should be near the, the top, and um, now you're in your Minecraft folder. Um, Normally, you would just see. Um, just thinking, what would be here? Maybe like this. Um, and now I'm gonna run Minecraft to um, so that I can force update, and um, this will get rid of all your previous mods. And some people say it gets rid of your achievements. I'm not sure about that. Um, you do. There's a high chance that you won't have to do this because too many items has great compatibility with other mods, so don't worry too much. But now I can close it. When you're uh, for the next steps, make sure Minecraft's closed, not on the game menu, but totally closed, or where nothing will work. Um, and now go into your bin folder. So here, um, right click the Minecraft executable jar, right click, open with, Minecraft archiver, and here's all Minecraft files, and now you're going to want to open up um, this jar files folder, and you can select all of these, or type control A, and then control C, and then control V to paste, or you can drag. Um, so this is all the files merged together, and now you can um, delete the meta and folder. So after you've done that, you can open Minecraft and close everything else. Um, run. And you have to make sure you delete the meta int folder if you don't. Um, the game will display a black screen. Um, and now I'll log in. And um, there you have it. So I'll just log into uh, my single player version of uh, the RIS world to show you the mod. So currently I only have cactus in my hand. But if I press. Um, E or I, whatever is your inventory uh, button, and um, if you force updated, uh, actually no, never mind. Um, 
So here is uh, the layout here. This, the, these are the save buttons. I don't really use that because why would you spawn um, items on a different save file? But it has all the items your Minecraft has. Uh, if mods have created items, then it has those as well. Um, so you can just click and it'll give you a full stack of that item if it can be stacked. Uh, like the glowstone items like that can be stacked. But if um, you right click, it'll only give you one. So, one clean stuff. And it's really cool. And so, and you can hide it as well. Um, pressing O. And then it's just like normal. So if you want to play um, legitly and you don't want to reinstall an uninstalled mod, then uh, this is a great method of just hiding it and uh, getting rid of any distraction. So, um, hopefully you like this tutorial. It's pretty easy. Um, if you have any questions, just post them in the comments below. We're going to be releasing a full RIS episode announcing the contest winners very, very soon. It's just that uh, school's pretty busy and these uh, tutorials are much faster to make. So, sorry about the wait on the normal episode, but uh, that's going to be very shortly. Um, for now, check out our episode 18. Uh, and uh, so the link is in the top. Uh, right corner and if this helped you just uh, subscribe it's free and it really helps us out so thanks and uh, have a great day